Hey, welcome to Happy Life Results Book Group. Hi there. We're in concept, um, hero concept number two, Up, and it's in the first part called Up, in the, it's the third, fourth paragraph, and it starts, the guide has been charged. So if you wanna find that in the text, uh, so I'll, I'll start. The guide has been charged with helping you to learn to master up, and the guidebook will be an essential tool for doing that because the guidebook was prepared specifically with you in mind. Mm -hmm. The guide has the advantage of knowing where you are coming from as they chart for you the path to the next horizon. Remember what we discussed earlier about the stages of internalization. Uh, figure out what stage you're at for each idea the guide presents and then implement a practice to move it to the next level. The guidebook has some prompts and tools to help get you going. Experiment with those as well as others that you come up with. Explore ways to implement and clarify each idea until it becomes a part of you. So the, so the guide's been charged <laughs> to help you to master up and, it, and he, the way that your guide has done it is perfect for you. It's unique to you. It's personalized. And um, so they know where you are, where you're coming from. And so we discussed earlier the stages of internalization. So if that's not familiar to you, maybe go back and kind of look, what do they mean by the stages of internalization? And we gave like the language learning analogy mm -hmm. and different tips and tools to help you with that. Um, figure out which, um, what stage you are at for each idea the guide presents. And that's a fun activity. You can actually list all nine concepts and say, how familiar am I with these concepts? Where am I at in my internalization? And if you want to refer to the language learning analogy, there are five phases, mm -hmm. five where you could say, okay, I'm just familiar with it. Mm -hmm. Or I'm, you know, like look at them and say, okay, which one am I? How, how comfortable I am with these ideas? Is it a part of who I am and, and, and that's the way I live? Or is it, I'm just getting to know the idea. <laughs> so those are the nice. two ends of the spectrum. Mm -hmm. and, and you can do this periodically and it's a great way to document your progress. If you want to kind of see, well, where was I at earlier? <laughs> and say, oh, wow, I was just getting familiar with everything two months ago. And now I would say this one I'm living you know, it's effortless for me, but this one I have to think really consciously about. I can do it, but it requires a lot of conscious thought, you know, things like that. So that's been a fun thing for me to do. And yep, in your guidebook, look for those tools and prompts um, and experiment with them. And then also others and share with us any that you come up with your own, your own tools and prompts, the way that you found to internalize up. I have found that every week I have another kind of focus for me and I it would have been nice if I would have always kept track of what they were so that I could share them with you but maybe I could um, create a list of different tools and prompts that I've used that weren't in the book that I I used mm. on my own that would be nice yeah, yeah I can do that that'd be nice and uh, this this is the introduction to remind you of the this the process here how the guide fits in and things like that we're in the hero stage, we're doing hero work. So th this is the lead up. Tomorrow you're going to get actual tasks, hero tasks, do this. Like this is all about how you put the principles to work. Yes. So, <laughs> yes. so this is just a lead in, get, get ready for the application tomorrow. Okay, see you tomorrow. Okay, see ya.